Hey guys, welcome back to another week in the instructional series. Today we're gonna to be working on some crossover drills. All you need is a big open space and some cones. So the first drill we're gonna do, it's called base fish and switches. Basically all this drill is trying to do is teach us how to load into our hips properly and how to load into our leg properly to get into that crossover step. So first thing Mitch is gonna do is Mitch is gonna put one foot on the line. He's gonna shift his weight so all his weight is over top of his one leg, okay? He's not leaving this leg way out here, okay? Because we can't, from when we're nice and wide, we can't really go anywhere from here. So we need to be in here because we need to be able to change direction. We need to, be able to go in one, wherever reacting to the play. So when I call switch, all that Mitch is gonna do is he's gonna quickly change this leg and replace it with the other and kick out and he's gonna replicate that same. So every time I say switch, switch, good, nice quick switch. Notice how Mitch's torso doesn't really move. Mitch's torso stays in place over top of that leg and over top of that foot. Ready, switch, switch, switch. Okay guys, so the next exercise is called a crossover base walk. This is gonna take that position that we just learned and apply it in a more dynamic manner. So Mitch is gonna set up, again, leaning on that lead leg. He's gonna load and push off of this leg. On the go, he's gonna sweep his other leg across his body, turn his hips to the direction he wants to go, and then quickly switch back into, the, into his hips. Okay, ready, go, go, go. Big long push, go. Good. So next guys, we've got our crossover three cone relay. So what this is gonna do is gonna take the two positions that we just did and make it a little, again, a little more integrative and a little more dynamic. So I'm just gonna start over top of the line loading in our start position that we started in. He's gonna run and as he approaches this first cone, he's gonna quickly flip his hips and he's gonna reach for it with the outside hand. What this is gonna do is gonna put us again in that same loaded position on our lead leg and it'll give us great angles coming in and out and then he's gonna drive aggressively off this front leg, sweeping the back leg across, turning his hips and then he's gonna do the same thing, returning the cone to the line, flipping his hips, setting it down with the outside hand, again, replicating the same position, loading the inside leg, that way he can push away and get out again, okay? So we're just gonna grab all three cones and bring them back to the line. Ready, go, big push, good. Guys, thanks for tuning in for another week of our instructional series. If you want to see more, Mitchie, what do they got to do? Subscribe, smash that like button, and comment. And tell us more what you want to see, and we'll deliver. Don't forget to ring that bell, notification squad. <laughs>